So if you're anything like me, you hate the Cortana search bar on Windows 10. And as a longtime Windows user, when I go to this search, I'm looking for something on my computer. I don't care about searching the internet for it. If I was going to do that, I would just go to a web browser. So I wanted to get rid of it. And when I originally looked into doing that, um, my search just led me essentially to out of date methods that doesn't work, that don't work anymore. So when I finally found this method to, um, to get rid of her, I decided I'd make a video just to help people like me who need that help. Um, it's actually really simple, but it's not very obvious. So if we go to our search and use Cortana for the last time, we type in R-E-G-E-D-I-T. So this is a registry editor. So we're going to run that. Now, yours isn't going to open up in this folder. This is where we want to end up. Um, so walking you through how to get there, and this needs admin rights, but hopefully you already have that. We go to H key current users, open that folder. Go down to software, open that folder. Now we're going to go down to Microsoft, open that folder. And we're going to go down to Windows, open that folder. Current version, open that folder. Go down to search and open that folder. Now we're in the folder that we want to be in. So this is what mine looked like when I first opened it. And what we need to do is we need to create a couple new things. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to right click new. We're going to do D word 32 bit value. And we're going to type in Bing search enabled. All right. Now we're going to do the same thing. Right click new D word 32 bit value. We're going to do allow search to use location. OK, so when you create these, they're automatically set to zeros. And that's good. That's what we want. Zero essentially means disabled and one means enabled. Now we're going to go up to Cortana consent. And if you don't have this, you're going to need to create it exactly the same way we did the others. Right click, new, D word 32 bit value, Cortana consent. So my Cortana consent was set to one, which is enabled. And we don't want that. We want to disable it. So double click on her and it's a one, set it to zero. Okay. Now if we pull up search, it's gone. Cortana's gone. She doesn't bother you anymore. Um, an example computer. Um, it just it searches on the computer. It doesn't search online for the word computer. That's it. So hopefully that helps. But let's say you change your mind. And you don't want her this anymore. You want to bring back Cortana. It's really simple. All we need to do is we just we delete by right clicking the two things we created being search enabled and allow search to use location delete. And then we're going to go to Cortana Consent, double click on her, and change that to a 1. And that will bring her back. But hopefully this was helpful. Um, as I said, I created this video because I, if anybody else is like me and, and looking for this solution, I hope it's helpful. So if it helped you out, feel free to, um, to like the video. I'd appreciate it. And um, have a good day.